the last page of your um, site survey clipboard is an attic inspection. So let's go and do that now. We're going to teleport to that attic location. Again, the critical thing to note here in terms of doing site survey is this is the kind of stuff that cannot be done with aerial photographs just from Google. This has to be done by the site surveyor on site, this stuff inside the house. So the first thing that we do, you can actually look around, you be inside here. First question that we ask is an obvious one. Is there an attic or is it a vaulted ceiling? You have a choice between the two. Uh, in this case, we can choose an attic. If it was a vaulted ceiling with no attic, that would be important for the guys to know so that they would not plan to do roof penetrations into the attic and running the conduit inside the house. They'd have to do it all on the roof. And that needs to be known uh, well ahead of time to plan out the job. What about the attic rafter size and the rafter spacing? We indicate that for you here. You'd take out a tape measure and you'd measure it. But in this case, we notice that the rafters are indicated as 2 by 8s. Uh, so we can pull that down. Uh, we either have 2 by 4s, 2 by 6s, 2 by 8s. Um, that's critical information in terms of the strength of the roof to support the array and also possible sizes of lag screws. And after attic rafter spacing, we have choices here of either 16 inches, 24 inches, or maybe something irregular. In this case, we point out that it's a 16 inch on center, so you're going to be able to select that. It's quite typical to have a 24 inch as well. And then finally, uh, we ask about water staining. You can actually just take a look around, take a careful look inside the attic here, actually look up on the ceiling, take a look around here as well, look around up here, see if there's any water staining already in the roof. This seems to be clear, there's no discolorations, but you do want to look for water staining to uh, tell that to the homeowner before you start the job because you don't want them saying, hey, your solar install gave me some water stains or you know some leaks in the roof, but they were already there. So you want to note whether they're there or not. In this case, I'm going to say that there's uh, no water stain present. And that's the finishing up of the uh, site survey uh, clipboard section for checking out the attic. Hey, thanks for watching the training video using Interplay's simulation-based training program. You can keep watching our solar videos by clicking on the link to your left or stay up to date on our latest solar snacks by subscribing on your right. To learn more about how the STP provides critical team training and helps you build an onboarding program at your company, please go to interplaylearning.com.